I'm Ascend Hyperion, and this is One Minute Halo. Almost 20 years ago, the Halo franchise established itself as a monolithic name in gaming, with Halo CE often being credited as the title that modernized the FPS game genre. But what many fans of the Halo franchise probably don't know is that the game wasn't always poised to be the first person shooter that carried the Xbox to success. In fact, in 1999, Halo was primed to make its debut as a Mac title and a third person shooter open world experience as well. That's right, only two years before the release of Halo CE as we know it, the franchise was set on a very different path. The title promised a reactive environment, even featuring a full-blown weather system. But in the year 2000, Bungie found itself on the brink of major income crisis, and in an attempt to save the studio, moved to be acquired by Microsoft. The rush to change Halo from what was shown in 1999 to a revolutionary flagship title was on, and while the journey was full of challenges, errors, and obstacles, it's pretty clear what the outcome was. Subscribe for more One Minute Halo, and if you want to dive deeper into the Halo franchise, check out my main channel linked below.